Assalamu alaikum. Alhamdulillah, Ekner Relief is here today in Washington, D.C. at the FEMA headquarters for the Volunteer Organization Partnership Day with FEMA. Uh, this is a really great event, mashallah, to just be able to meet and see all the other organizations. As you can see around me, all the other organizations that work in disaster relief, whether they be faith-based or community-based, are here today to present the kind of work they do, the scope of work that they do, so we can better partner with them in projects when disasters occur. Hi, my name is Miriam Gello. I'm a FEMA volunteer agency liaison at headquarters in Washington DC um, we partner very closely with IGNA Relief and uh, they've done great work out in the field one of our great voluntary organization partners um, I work very closely with sister Jane and it, it's just a great working relationship and thank you all for everything that um, that you guys do for the disaster survivors. Uh, my name is Peter Gaditis, and I'm the executive director of New York Disaster Interfaith Services and the president of the National Disaster Interfaith Network. And I've been working with uh, ICNA Relief since 9-11 uh, response, uh, where uh, ICNA was one of the founding organizations of the disaster interfaith in New York City. I also work often with Jay and Aslam, really value our partnership and the role that the Muslim community plays in national resilience around the United States. Imagine that you wake up at about 3 o'clock in the morning and there's water on your floor. It's above your ankles. Do you know what to do? Do you know how to get out of your house safely? Who do you call? What do you bring with you? These are the types of things that we can talk about during disaster preparedness workshops. Ignor Relief USA provides disaster response services, disaster preparedness services, disaster recovery services. What is, what is the importance of, of disaster relief? First and foremost, we do it because it's uh, it's the sunnah of the Prophet and uh, also bringing that uh, Muslim presence in the face of disaster relief. We are trying to empower our Muslim brothers and sisters, those who live around us. We want to make sure they can get they can get this sense of understanding and get this feeling of helping of a fellow American when disaster happens. So we can help them and give them empowerment so they can stand up on their feet and become a positive member of society.